make way to the frontier. By attacking our largest refueling depot, the militia thinks they can shut the door on us. You will correct that perspective. Graves out. Pilots, defend the hard points at all costs. If the militia overload the reactor core, it's all over. Strap Anvil 1 is gone. Anvil 2 standing by. Anvil 3 is good to go. Anvil 4 is a go. I hate this part. reinforcements from reaching the frontier for years.
did. Restoring normal core pressure near the terminal. Be advised, your Titan is neutralized. Constructing replacement. Stand by. years ago. Instead, you gave me the ship. Sir, I've got the master in my sights. I'm going after it. Stand by. Blisk, hold your fire. You're going to rupture a coolant circuit and blow the place to hell. Hand-to-hand -hand combat only. Move. With pleasure, sir.
Vice Admiral Graves. I am picking up a spike in the reactor core. McCallan. Vice Admiral, McCallan's locked himself in the reactor core chamber. He'll be bloody dead in minutes. That chamber's completely irradiated. Blisk, there's nothing you can do. Get to your ship and get out of there. Marcus, I've got the reactor system pulse detonate. And all the coolant in the system isn't going to save this place anymore. <laughs> Vice Admiral Graves, McAllen has destabilized the core. Shutting down the reactor now will cause a reverse pulse detonation. This will result in the destruction of Demeter. The situation is untenable. Frame override at 50%. Good. I have control back for this terminal. Reducing core pressure. militia insurgents. Reports are sketchy, but indications are that the refueling facilities sustained major damage in the battle. Numerous casualties are... They just cut us off from the core systems. James We're stuck McCall. on the wrong side of the frontier, sir. Yes, we are. The whereabouts of several high-ranking officers involved in the conflict, including Vice Admiral Marcus Graves, is presently unknown. <laughs> 